Hello, this is Builder Elephant, and welcome back to another review of the Simpsons minifigure series. Today, we will be taking a closer look at minifigure number 9, Milhouse Van Houten. Milhouse, Mussolini Van Houten, is the best friend of Bart Simpson. This gullible and insecure friend is often taken advantage of by Bart. He also tends to be a main target of the schoolyard bullies and has an unrequited love with Lisa Simpson. He is the son of Kirk and Luann Van Houten. While his mom has confidence, he takes after his father's low self-esteem. Milhouse was the most prominent recurring child character to appear early on in the show. He made his debut in the 1988 Butterfinger commercial. He was part of the Butterfinger group. This was back when The Simpsons was just a cartoon short on the Tracy Ullman show. The leg piece puts Milhouse in his red shorts and red shoes. A tiny yellow stripe pattern is used for the skin color of his legs. This design on the non-bendable kid legs are only available in the Lego Simpsons theme. The only other character to use this design is the Lisa Simpson minifigure. But since her piece is mostly covered with a wraparound cloth dress piece, these stand out as belonging to Milhouse. The torso piece is only found with this Milhouse minifigure. Milhouse is wearing his classic lavender t-shirt. The lack of detail on the shirt itself is from the cartoon having him wear a plain shirt, rather than a shortcut used by the LEGO design team. Today's torso pieces are extremely detailed, but when this series came out, having the dual colored arms was rare, so to give a character short sleeves was a big deal for the collectible minifigure series. The unique head perfectly captures Milhouse's appearance in the cartoon. The straight blue hair parted to the side looks great. Of course, Lego included his big eyebrows, since Milhouse is one of the few characters to actually have eyebrows on his face. His distinct large nose is a mirror image to his cartoon appearance. Even the mouth and ears look great. I love that his red framed glasses are part of the mold and not just printed onto the head. This adds some great texture and helps his glasses, which are often used as a comedic prop, stand out even more. It's because of these glasses jokes that we know Milhouse is nearsighted. Milhouse was given a copy of the Biclops comic for his accessory. A 2x2 two two tile piece has the comic cover printed on it. This comic is a direct reference to the 11th episode of season 12, worst episode ever. Milhouse loved this glasses-wearing hero who looked a lot like him, but he was the only one. This comic, published by LensCrafters, almost put the Android's Dungeon and Baseball Card Shop out of business when Milhouse ordered 2,000 copies for the store. The printing did a wonderful job matching the comic book we saw in the show. While the football players were removed, everything else is almost spot on. Biclops' pose, the green background, and even the action smack are included on the piece. I liked this piece when it came out, but loved it when the Simpsons Series 2 CMFs came out because that series had a Millhouse minifigure dressed as Fallout Boy, which makes me wonder, did Lego know they were going to make a Millhouse comic book character, or did the printing piece inspire the Series 2 choice? Milhouse was a great inclusion for the first series of Simpsons CMF characters. As Bart's best friend, one of the original recurring cast members, and a prominent Springfield Elementary School student, he's second only to the Simpsons family children. Lego did an amazing job designing this character. The headpiece looks fantastic, and that 2x2 two two printed tile piece is great. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe or check out some of our other videos. Until next time, let's keep building together.